99 Mike Trout. We are gonna have him in left field next to Mickey Mantle Prestige. Ranked seasons, game number one for my guy Mike Trout. I have been trying him out in the new event that's currently in the game, starting to work towards his prestige. He's 11 for 18 with six home runs and a double. Like I said in yesterday's videos, I'm super pumped about this card, happy he's in the game. If you haven't seen his events debut or how to unlock him, that video went up yesterday along with a huge pack opening where we pulled a lot of really good diamonds. <laughs> Lineup today, top to bottom, Roman Robinson, creative player, shortstop, Mike Trout, Mickey Mantle, David Ortiz, Gary Sheffield, Larry Walker, Craig Biggio, Robinson Cano, and pitcher spot, of course, on the bench. We'll have Prestige, Tommy, Cody Bellinger, J.D. Martinez, Chipper Jones, and Jimmy Rollins. We are five strikeouts away from Prestige and Tom Hinkie. I'm going to try and get him innings today. We are 10 base hits and five runs away from Prestige and David Ortiz, so hopefully we can get some damage done with him today. And I'm 18 base hits away from Prestige and Larry Walker, so another guy that we need to look out for today. We're sitting at a 744, and we're going to make it happen. We're going to hop in now with Mike Trout's debut. Hit that thumbs up down below if you enjoy. If you're excited. And I got one question for the comment section down below. Do you think this collection is the end of it? Or do you think they'll add to it later on? They did leave some collections off the table. What if they added an 18 collection slot with another reward? Because, again, there's 18 different vouchers you could technically pick up for that Trout collection. You only needed 15. They gave themselves room to play around. All right, and as expected, as usual in ranked seasons, we got Kluber versus Kluber. He's leading off that Ty Cobb card. Haven't seen a lot of him. Interested. I'm very interested. Ripped. First swing of the game is a sinker out over the plate. That center barrel, good timing, but as usual, if you're a tick on the late side of good, the ball just dies in the air. Mike Trout is beautiful. He's majestic out there. Mike Trout again. Goodbye. That was as close to perfect as you're going to get without it not being perfect. That ball was laced. I'm sorry, man. I got to run it. Ow. Top of the first in a big play. Oh! Like that, they take the lead. But even that 98 exit below, it's because I was a tick on the late side of good. That ball could have jumped off the bat 110. David! We're nine base hits away. Sheffield, I power swung, but I was under it. I power swung and ship it, though. You never know. That got out! Oh, Sheffield, man, he's a glitch. He is a glitch. Now, Larry Walker, that could carry. That's deep to center, but it looks like it's going to stay in the yard. Little off the PCI. <laughs> At Sheffield Homer was pure luck. Trout, though, hit a bomb. First pitch to Ty Cobb, and we got one down. Ground ball to right side. David Ortiz can do no wrong. He's got Ty Cobb swing on his created player. He must really like Ty Cobb. Get down, Craig. Not quite. Robbie! We get another! We are all over Kluber here. Whoa! Again? Yikes! Fly ball out to right. Poppy, first man out in the second. It's weird. I have two swings that could have been homers. That kind of died in the air, and then the Sheffield ball, we were completely under it, but I think me power swing is what got that over the wall. Seeger out to right. Why is the ball dying in ship it? This is weird. This is weird. The score of this game is usually 8-7 by now. Fly ball out to left, and another three up, three down inning for Kluber. I got to get eight innings with Indians pitchers for the sixth inning program. Almost hit me there. It's 2-0. I'm going to be aggressive here, too. Oh, give me something to hit. Get up! He does it again! This one is perfect! That home run doesn't count, and I'm so mad. This guy, that guy we just played, is a straight-up bum. A bum, that guy is. A bum! I am so upset. It is man. I am just flabbergasted right now that someone would do such a thing. I'm all for raging, guys. I've been there. I feel you. I've been there. Let the ball land, please. It's just common courtesy.
Let the ball land, man. All right, rank ratings now up to 765. So we're climbing towards championship series. I'll get another rank seasons video up tomorrow. Might even be wager wheel. If you want to see wager wheel, hit the thumbs up down below. Let me know in the comments section if you want to see wager wheel tomorrow. We're going to keep playing a little bit of events today. Might as well get an events game or two in since we got a rage quit early in a ranked game. As we continue to work towards these prestiges again, David Ortiz had a hit and run in that game. He's now just nine base hits away from being prestige. The one I didn't note before this rank season season's game was Sheffield. I need 17 RBIs with Gary Sheffield. That's now down to 15. His three-run homer in that game was actually the last hit we needed to complete him. So we just got to get the RBIs and he's going to be done. This is going to be a fun card to debut because I love his swing. Someone in chat yesterday asked me why I've been doing this. I'm starting Hanky in these games because we are just five strikeouts away from prestiging him. So I'm working on them stats. We got to deal with James Paxton on the mound in this one. Hard ground ball to third. Good curveball down out of the zone. One, two. All right. Two up, two down on our end. Trout actually recorded an out. Good slider. Sit down, bud. Four strikeouts away. Two down. Blow it by him. Blow it by him. Yes! Too much play, but we blew it by him. We're one away. Good pitch. Sit down, baby. Let's go. Got him. How about one more for good measure, chat? Fizio, much better swing there than the rest of the game, but it doesn't get down. I'll take that. Something to build on. Brian Roberts. Very good swing. Again, right at him. All right, Mano off the bench. Gonna have to do damn. We have not gotten a base runner in this game. Yikes. Mickey with a knock. Come on, Jim Bob. Come on, man. I'm not scared of that heater. Trout's going to come up with two on. Michael! Michael! That's his third homer of this video. He just, he's nonstop. He's too good. Why are we focused on Hinky? Show me Trout. Wow. See you later, bud. Just running with the bat. He's taking the bat with him. One down. I'm just going to go ahead and get these three outs with Dibble. We're going to have Prestige Hanky on lock. I'm so hyped about this. Yes! This guy hasn't been able to handle the heater. Duh! That is an impossible pitch to touch. Impossible. Why are we looking at Hanky? I want to see Mike. Where is he? I don't even want to see the infield. I want to see Mike. Yeah, come on in here. Jimmy's waving him in. Where's Mike? Everyone greet Michael. Good game, Poppy. Thanks, Jimmy. I appreciate it, man. Didi, why are we looking at Hanky? Correa trying to make sure Joe Kelly isn't out there before he just makes his way towards the mound. Player of the game was, in fact, Mike Trout with that three-run homer. Let's go get updated on prestige stats and check out this Tom Hanky card. Hey! Bang! A little red diamond action on a Wednesday morning. Gonna go ahead and add him to the bullpen, of course, for the 97. That's another 99 on the squad. Our fourth prestige card unlocked, and we're gonna have many, many more over the next week or so. We're also one win away from unlocking the 94 silver slugger Justin Upton through this event. I would at least get him some at-bats off the bench and ranked as we make our way towards World Series. I really like his swing. You can get him a couple at-bats against a lefty. Why not? Try him out. Trout's 13 for 21 with nine extra base hits already. This guy is crazy good. And for those of you that were in my comment section yesterday telling me that the at-bats don't matter, you only get five points for collecting Mike Trout. You have to do the at-bats. They put it there for a reason. You don't think I looked at that before I talked about it? I want to say David Ortiz is going to be the next one that we unlock with the nine base hits. The runs are gonna happen because at least four of his nine hits are gonna be homers. And then Sheffield might follow him. The 15 RBIs are gonna be tough. I know how annoying RBIs can be, especially when you're trying to get them. I was trying to get RBIs with Mickey Mantle and I would bring him off my bench anytime I got runners in scoring position and he would just get intentionally walked half the time. So it took forever to do the RBIs with Mantle. He's gotta hope Sheffield gets some more opportunities with runners on. But again, I might just try and use him off the bench to pinch hit. We just then have to hope he doesn't get walked too much. The next pitcher I'm going to be trying to finish is going to be Hershiser. It's going to take a little while. I got a lot of innings I got to do. 
Um, actually, 46 innings isn't that many. And I use him in ranked on my main squad. So I'm gonna be using him on the World Series run and in the event. This one's actually gonna be unlocked pretty quick. After David Ortiz, Larry Walker will probably be next, and then Sheffield will follow Larry Walker. We were, we're gonna have so many debuts over the next week or so. If you guys are excited, hit that thumbs up down below. Let me know in the comment section, what do you think about Mike Trout? Hit that follow button on Twitch if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at RealShelfie as well, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.